Lionel Fanthorpe is world renowned for his tireless pursuit of paranormal activity as well as being a prolific author he also happens to live locally. We caught up with him as Cardiff Met honoured his writing. Uh, Lionel, hi. Hello. Hi. How long? I always thought you were from Cardiff because you do sound a little bit Cardiff. Well, I've, I've been here 40 years. I've been here 40 yeah. years. It does sound yeah. Cardiff, doesn't it? <laughs> Why, what, what is it about Cardiff that's kept you here? Well, we, we came here back in 79 um, when I was appointed as headmaster of Glendaro High School in Ely. Right. And uh, we just, after I retired, we've just been here ever since. I remember um, reading somewhere, obviously because you were um, a religious man, you were a priest. Yes. Yes. Um, and then a lot of the paranormal stuff, some would say, doesn't fit into the Christian faith. And I remember you saying that these are puzzles given to us by God. Do you still stand by that? Yes, I would. Yeah. Um, I would say that everything in every... You see, I'm also fascinated by the modern theories of parallel universes and probability tracks. Right. And that there may be, vast as the universe is, it may only be one of an infinite number of parallel universes. And when we think about a probability track, there's the probability that you and I would meet up again tonight and do this piece for your TV show. Um, and there's also the possibility that the car might have broken down, that I might not have got here, that you might have had a problem getting here. You are a ridiculously prolific writer. At one point, I did read that you were writing a novel every 12 days. In a th there was a three-year period where you were churning out, churning out. You were creating a novel every 12 days. Did you use time travel? And I don't knowingly use time travel. I can't adjust the dial on my Fitbit and say, we'll make it five o'clock again as I've got rather a lot to do. That would be so handy. Wouldn't yeah. it be great? Yeah, yeah. No.